Hey guys, Caleb Nance here from CalebNance.com. I uh, just thought I'd do a template tutorial um, how to change templates, um, also how to see the module positions on the templates, and uh, just basically uh, really basic stuff with um, templates on your site, your Joomla site. Uh, this is the front end, it's kind of a preview of the template I'm going to be doing. It's going to be a free template with um, a couple things that you can do to it. I'll, I'll show it to you at the end, uh, but right now this is the template that I have uh, published to my front end. Um, we're going to go to the back end, uh, administrator, and login, and then we're going to go to extensions, and then template manager. And this brings up all the templates that you have installed um, on your site. Um, to install more, you would go to install right here under extensions, and it'll have a browse uh, place where you can browse your desktop t for another template that you have on there, and uh, just upload it there, and it will be listed right here. Um, this is the template uh, that is currently um, the default of the front end. It'll have that right there, that little star. Uh, let's say we want to do uh, J purity and then we select it with that uh, bullet button and then hit default up here at the top right and now as you see default is set to J purity then we go in the front end and refresh the page and we'll show this um, as you see the module position and stuff is kind of out of whack um, this is not working too good and have a couple positions right here because every template has uh, different module positions. Um, if you add, to see all those module positions on the template, if you add um, question mark equals TP equals one, no, sorry, TP equals one, like that, and you hit send, then it'll show you every position on this template as you see some of them don't have any uh, modules published to them but they're still showing so it shows every single uh, position on that template and this helps whenever you're trying to uh, publish modules to positions that you don't know is there or where they are um, and to see a list of that you would go to modules and I'll go into the mobile modules this is also a free module that I've made um, to see the positions, this is how you set a position right here. Let's do, I think it's user 3. Um, no. We'll do top so it's right here. I'll show you how that's done. Um, we go to top and then hit apply. And now that should be right here whenever I hit uh, enter. Take this TP off. And there it is right there. All right, that's how you would do that. Um, see all the positions. Um, all right, let's change that back to the left side and hit save. And then go back to my templates and set that back to uh, that free template I've been doing. And now it should be the same. There we go. And that's how easy it is to change templates. Also, you can change. Um, templates for each page let's say you wanted one page to have a different look well then you would actually click into the template and go to select from list and let's say we want uh, sample 2 to just be a different template this template instead of the template that is defaulted um, you can also uh, hold down control and select 2 or 3 whatever you want but right now I'm just going to do sample 2 and then you're going to hit apply and we're going to refresh the page and then click on the main menu sample 2 and there it is so it's just that page that is set differently for this deep, uh, template and as you you know any other page is going to be this this template um, that's how you do that but we're going to set it back to none and save that um, <clears throat> told you I would uh, show you a little bit of preview for the free template I'm about to do. 
Uh, it's it's got a couple things kind of cool. Um, it's gonna have different colors. Um, IE6, uh, but also it's gonna have a iPhone template and also kind of a JavaScript um, function with this iPhone template. So when you're looking at your site uh, upright, it knows that. But then when you turn it to the left or to the right, it'll be able to have um, go into different pages uh, automatically. So I think that's kind of a cool function um, that I added onto this. Uh, you know, you can have your template types, uh, you know, just left module and just right module. Um, also, IE6, if you want them to upgrade. I don't support IE6 because <laughs> I hate it. And so I gave this function to you. Also, um, working on the uh, BlackBerry template, um, much like the iPhone template, it, it doesn't have a lot more, it doesn't have a lot of functionality as the iPhone does, but. Um, it's still going to be pretty cool. So that is kind of a preview of what I'm doing with this. And if you have any questions or anything, you can go to calebnance.com. And uh, once my template's up, I'll probably put it on uh, my site. It'll be under calebnance.com uh, forward slash downloads. And it'll be under the template uh, area on that page. And I hope you learned a lot. And if you have any questions, go to kelvinettes.com. Uh, contact me. Contact us. Fill out that form. Uh, give me a heads up on what you think about it. And also, if there's anything I can go over for you. And I hope you have a good day. Thank you.